hello my little munchkins crones and sunflowers how are you on this fine monday evening well it's late you know i took and crashed out baby Con, i feel like i missed you if i look kind of like sleepy mama was tired <laughs> baby Con, i so appreciate your patience and i appreciate you just being patient with me because i was just sleepy and I know that it's just taking you out of your way, but your baby crumb. This little cute, cute baby crumb got cold. So anyway, with that being said, mm -hmm. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day. It's this, this is Tuesday, yes? Yeah. Okay. So baby crumb, what's going on in the news? What's going on in the news? Did, did, did you know before we start? We're going to read on Zendaya, but before I read on her, I want to do a quick read on her. But in the meantime, let's just do a quick recap. What do you want to do a recap? What is, oh, what's going on with Diddy during the time that I took a nap? <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Well, Diddy, what, what I mean, what is it new about Diddy? Mm -hmm. So firstly, apparently his one of his sons, Christian Combs, mm -hmm. is now a part of the whole Diddy allegations and because he because he is apparently helping with the women, I guess trafficking the women. So so but they haven't uh, they haven't accused him Diddy of anything. No, they're still all allegations. And I'm telling you, what did I say? I they I don't know what they have and I don't know what they looking for, but I assure you they ain't got it all. Because if they did, they're like hungry like the wolves. Oh, yes. They will gobble him, his children, and everything. If it doesn't do um the what it do, the feds good is to take somebody down. They just get rubbed up with that. Their ego, they like police officers, just to lock somebody up. Yes take them they feel like they done did the do and i'm telling you it is like that and so from where i'm sitting they this is this is they're going for bigness when they do this okay. they've been watching this for this has been this is years in the making okay and it's just that somebody must have dropped the bone and you know who was dropping the bone jaguar right she's dropping that same bone you tell me this out of all the people that diddy has messed with slept with slopped with mm -hmm. cheated with stole with danced with philandered with whatever yeah. you mean to tell me they ain't go after jay-z at all no nope, you yet. go after jennifer lopez right Ashton Kutcher. You go at the Meek Mills, who allegedly I heard a tape where he was doing the woobity wobbity boop and moaning and with allegedly. <laughs> yes, and I the like guy it. that stole the tape, guess what? He filmed it because he said he smoked weed. He didn't drink alcohol and they spiked the alcohol. And he said, that's what he heard. Well, Cheryl, you don't know, you don't know what on top of that, on top of that, they, they really trying to get his son for something. And if that's going to make Diddy break, it'll be messing with his kids. Just like a mama bear. Just like a mama bear. I could take a lot, but when you mess with my child, it's like when you're a mother, You, if you're a, a mother, a mother understand this feeling. You could take a lot, but the moment you see your baby in pain, you don't care how old they are. It's something about it. When you see your little boy or your little girl sick and in pain, it's something about it that melt your heart. And I'm saying it has to be a tremendous time in the it was Cone's household yes. to live under this, never knowing, not knowing when they're going to come. And do I think I've said it from the day one, the bus was ridiculous, but why not put on a grand show? <laughs> if I want to shake up Hollywood, they did it. They look like sure. a movie, okay, from the 1950s <laughs> where where you got James Cagney. I mean, this is before my time. Was like, nah. We're going to get you. Oh, oh. <laughs> How they go? Yeah. 
We're going to get you, buddy. You best to believe it. You bet your bottom dollar that we're going to get you. How they used to talk about, like, in the those and those old movies. Yeah. <laughs> you know, those black and white movies. Yeah. We're taking you down, buddy. We're taking you down. You know, so, um, and with that being said, now, another quick cat form news. This is another thing. I don't know how true it is, but they done raining, um, um, uh, what's her name? Kim Kardashian house. Was it, could you look it up? It wasn't Balenciaga. It was, um, was it Balenciaga? She stole some clothes. And apparently they went. How are you gonna find them clothes? You ain't gonna find them clothes with Kim. Kim got yes. It, Kim it was Balenciaga. Balenciaga. They took and raided. Did they raid her house? Is that real for some clothes? What? Kim is a thief. She stole from who? Balenciaga. She stole from Jay. She stole from um. She stole mad money from um, her boyfriend, Ray J's parents, mm -hmm. you know, she's always, she stole from Kanye. She yes. stole from other people. It's just a matter of time before she get caught. She's a thief. They stole, that's what they do. I yes. mean, and they living way beyond their means. For real. You know? They living way beyond their means. And not only that, to top off with Kim Kardashian, I don't know if you heard the latest. The latest is, is that not only that, but um, Justin Bieber is suing her for the deterioration of his marriage because he said that the Kardashians, Kim in particular, has tarnished her mind and made her want a divorce from him and they are blaming he is blaming the kardashian this is real talk isn't it yeah this is crazy. real talk about kim and 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 and, and diddy it's yes. like kim got jealous yes. it's like she made that phone call to diddy and next thing you know she being raided i'm telling you things are coming That's down so oh speaking of which Mm -hmm. Apparently, I heard it from CBJ say it himself. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He was in Diddy's home in Florida when it got raided. He wasn't there. No, he said he was there. Oh, he was in Diddy's home. Oh, they we saw it from California. Oh, yes. and he and he was. I think he said he was in the studio. On the island in Florida, where his where Diddy's house was located, mm -hmm. and at first he said that he heard like a thumping or like a knocking sound, like something mm -hmm. like fell over, mm -hmm. and then suddenly the they bust in and they just like he said that he was only detained at the time. Is that right? Yes, that is right. That's how Stevie J says it. So he was only detained, and they never locked him up. No, they just put the handcuffs on him, set him on the grab somewhere. How humiliating, the, 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 the demoralizing, actually, mm -hmm. especially if you, especially with his sons, if you never did anything. Now, where was Diddy in all this? Everyone says that Diddy was ready to go, but from what I'm understanding, that's not true. Um, the way the media puts it is that this is the story. Diddy was apparently about to vacation with his daughters. So they were in a Florida airport, mm. I guess, to travel maybe outside of the country right. the moment this raid happened. They wasn't running. They were just taking a vacation like they normally do. And the raid happened. And, and there were many people that says he was fleeing the country. He had no idea. Did, was he warned? I don't think so. It was curious that Kimberly, that the Kardashians, what did, what happened with them? They they disconnected mm -hmm. with them. What what a hour? How how soon? Oh, well, I, I know you told me it, we get so much news. It's hard to remember everything. But anyway, Kardashians was walking with them, and we, they were friends. And she cut them off. And also, I see. Um, what is the man's name? He does the comedian, Nick, Nick, Nick Cannon. Yes. He's, he wants to support him, but he's like, I don't know if I want to get in. I don't know if this is wise. It's mm -hmm. like, I don't know if it's anything with the trafficking. I, I can't, bro. I can't do it. But 
is it true? No, he hasn't been true. None of it has. They haven't proved anything. This is what they're trying to do. They're trying to, but if you ask me, they botched up bad. What do you mean? Especially the way they left that man's house. Yes. The, the way they went in, they botched that up so bad now speaking about that going back to kimberly they didn't show the raids right in her house no. so she gets to go under the wire because of the big news with diddy they putting it out there but this little thief over there that little thief kimberly she's getting a wallop too but everybody is focused on her i mean focused on diddy and what's going on that she's going under the radar but that little that little one over there, that Kimberly, she's over there getting busted for thievery. Mm -hmm. And Balenciaga wanted their merch back. And I don't know if they found it because Kim showed you she got wardrobes with, 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 with probably a thousand feet long, bigger than stores. So I don't know if they got her merch. She probably said, you can come on. I can take you to. And this one of her little... um storage areas and it would they probably wouldn't they like that no, i can't find nothing <laughs> in this you understand what i'm saying so it's a lot going on in the news what do you think baby clown yes indeed so anything else that we should know i tell you guys if you should listen to that video would would they say a meek mills out there moaning and groaning and slapping and papping you know what it's not so many people this man has sleep you know what i have come to the point that P. Diddy is a hoe. <laughs> yeah, he definitely is that. He's a hoe. A man hoe. And I, a man hoe. And I wonder, do he favor men more than he favor women? It looks like it he like. favor the booty more than he does the tootie. It seems like. Baby Clone, laugh the, at the, that the, one. Uh, I will, I will you have to let it marinate. Yes, the tootie. The booty versus the tootie. That's just think what you think that is. Yes, yes. I, I, he he favors that because he says that, but what he likes with the females, allegedly, he likes to watch. And every now and then he participate, but from where it's gathering to me, he liked the booty more than he liked the tootie. And this is, can I, can I talk about it? Okay. What's frightening for me and if I was a female, now this may sound crazy. And you know what they used to call a truffle butter? Oh. Okay. My thing is, if I was in a situation, I would always be afraid that I'm going to get some kind of STD. Understandable. You know, mm -hmm. because I, I just feel because honestly, that is one of the most disgusting ways to have relationships. Yeah. It wasn't intended for that. However, I really don't know, but I heard the sensation is tremendous yeah, that's what in a said. good way. I wouldn't know. I, I'm just befuddled with it. So, mm -hmm. so what do you think, baby clone? Yeah, that's pretty much it. The only other thing I think about is poor, poor JLo. Because it just seems like people aren't a huge fan of J-Lo. Oh, but J-Lo was J-Lo. Oh, man. Even when I did a reading, it didn't do good. I mean, people are not favoring her. They don't like her. They call her a liar. She didn't. She wasn't no Jenny from the block. She had money. She went to a camp. Why you lie, though? Jennifer, why you lie? Not cool. Mm -hmm. Your lies will seek you out. That well. Well, I think that's all we got right now. What do you think, baby Cone? Just a little quick up recap of the news or what's going on. We just wanted to stop in, let you know we're on it. It ain't much, but we're on it. Oh, mm -hmm. um, yes. If we're going to be talking about news real quick, let's not forget the fact that um, Cody Brown from Sister Wives is blaming TLC for the loss of his son. Isn't that horrible? Accountability. Accountability. Did he said when he looks back at the videos, it makes him sick. You should be vomiting. Yes. 
You, they are etched in stone. And you know what I got to say that God is trying to tell you something yeah, right. because you got to watch that for the rest of your life. That'll never go away. And the way you treated your kids, mm -hmm. it is documented. You can blame TLC all you want, my love, but it was you. Yes. Maybe you were shrinking your beer or whatever, <laughs> your bud, whatever you were shrinking. But I'm telling you, you and your wife, Robin, set that family on fire. Yeah. You all came in and you wrecked it with a wrecking ball. Mm -hmm. So you can blame anybody you want, but it is you who have done this. It is you who have caused this forest fire. Yes. You. And in the process of the burning, you lost your son. And, yeah. and then you're going to have Mary going to be the one. Don't blame people. No, I'm not blaming anything. The evidence point that he died not at peace with his son. Yes. I'm not blaming him for anything. So you're saying, Mary, that if somebody does something to my daughter, which causes her to delete, don't blame them? Are you kidding me? He's his father. He denied his child. Right. I don't think Mary wants to look at that part. Because it's not your only daughter. I mean, sorry, it's not your only son. Mm -hmm. that's why but if it was your son you would feel differently and I'm not saying you didn't love him I'm not saying that it just seems like you're back on that again accountability there are some things that ain't got nothing to do with you Mary yeah. that's between him and his maker not you and your opinion and what do I think you're dead going straight we've seen it Mary yes. it's evidence yes. you know it you were just all up in Cody's booty at the time and Mary Coochie at the time just trying to get a name for yourself trying to get in the cut but they still didn't want you and so now you're going to stay up there and do it I know it's harsh but you got to understand Mary there are some things that we just have to reap what we sow yes and what Cody has done, he got to live with it with the rest of his life. It's got to haunt him and her. But mainly, that wasn't her son. That was Cody's son. Yes. One of his baby boys. Mm -hmm. So shame on Cody. Do I feel sorry for him? Not at all. I feel sorry that he didn't get to say, I'm sorry. Yes, that is true. So that, that, that burns me up. So it's just curious how everybody's doing something just to blame somebody. But let me go back to Diddy before I close this out. One of the things that I do love about Diddy is this. He's owning it. Okay. He's owning it. The number was he's doing the best he can. He take his That's kids true. out. He, you know, he's just doing the best he can. He's just waiting. He's like, I paid big money. They told me the rest. They told my lawyers told me everything going to be all right. And I believe it. And if they had something, they would take him yes. and they getting everybody else. You just asked me, they don't want to everybody, but you ain't never go to Jay-Z yet. Oh my goodness, you know it's something up with that baby crown. Yes, definitely. So Suspicious. is there anything else? No, I think we've covered everything. I think we'll just talk about Zendaya later then, huh? Okay. Okay, well then that's what we have for you. And with that be saying, you have anything else to say? Just a quick recap. Man, I'm really trying to think if there's anything else left out there to say. It's everything has been taken care of. I just want to step in, tell you about Cody. I want to tell you about Kim. And most of all, I want to keep you up on what's going on with Diddy. So we're going to be checking in with this because we're in this story, right? Yes. So with that being said, 